Gentlemen, good morning. I hope you're well. Today we're going to be setting up our Sigma bot for trading. If you've used it or you've seen it, I currently use this bot. I've reset my wallet just to make this tutorial. And in this video, what we're going to show you is what you have to set up, how to use it. And we're going to show you the basic simple ones. If you've never used a trading bot, this video is for you. So the first thing you want to do is load up your bot and save your private key somewhere safe. If you lose your telegram, you lose whatever's in your wallet here, there's no way to get it back. That's the first thing you need to do. You can also import it into maybe your MetaMask or something like that, if you don't wanna write the seed phrase down. Now, three steps I want you to do. The first one is go to chains. Pick whatever chain you're on. I basically use BSC only for this. I do sometimes use it on Solana, but they have a number of chains. So select the chain you want to trade on, go to settings. Now this is the important part. We're going to configure it in a way where we're not going to spend too much money on gas. And we're also going to configure it in a way that suits your trading style. Now, for example, gas button. You can see here the GUI is set very high. This is very sniper style settings. I'll give you an example of what these buttons mean and how to preset them. So we're going to go here and just click a random transaction. And this will show us this person used 0.05 GUI to buy. You can check others if you like, just to see the sort of average. Yeah, so this person used 0.05 to buy as well. This is the default gas setting. If we go on 10, it's very high. So I'm gonna go with 0.1 for that. That's my usual setting, sometimes 0.1. One five, I do, but that's if you're normal trading. If you're trying to buy a launch, sure, 10 Gwei is about a dollar, I believe. I could be mistaken, so bear that in mind. This is going to cost you two cents to trade. Very important because these fees add up big time. Yeah, so if you're spending a dollar each trade, you can do that now. As you can see, Sigma I've been using for years. 0.1 was $20 at one point and when I was trading on it. So you want to put your default setting. That's $1 or around that. That's 0.05 like that. So you can change your setting according to how much you buy. You can also manually do it when you're actually trading, but I have it helpfully uh, like that. Now, pretty much your positions manual buyer copy trading we're not going to go into auto snipe i've never actually used but i do know how to set it up i'm going to make a more detailed one so it's very simple now we're going to send some money into our wallet so click wallet and we're going to copy here all you need to do is just click this or you can copy paste and then we're going to just send some bnb in very simply forgive me this is metamask it's probably going to lag we're going to copy here and then we're just going to send in 0.01 like so send a small amount play with it adjust your settings because what you won't want to do is send two thousand dollars in and then you find out you're spending thirty dollars in gas fees so make sure everything works perfectly now we're going to simulate a buy on asta once this is done and we're just going to copy and paste like so you can see here our I didn't save our buy setting, but or our wallet one didn't save, but we've got our gas setting here. And if you want to buy, the X is how much you want to put. You can also buy max transaction, but pretty much no one has max transaction now. We've got our wallet one, which is our gas setting, and we're going to simulate a buy now. Now I'm going to type it in like so. I've missed the zero. And then that will show us our buy which has been confirmed. So it's pretty quick and we're going to check on BSC scan how much we spent. So we spent 0 0.00001 in transaction fee, so which was about two cents. And we went in above average GUI, double GUI. So we're faster than 99% of people. We brought $1 and we can actually go in and take a look at our positions now which should be here and we'll be able to see how it's all going and refresh it and stuff like that, which is fine. It, the only thing that Sigma doesn't do, it doesn't give a really, really good, if you do a small buy, it doesn't give a percentage amount of how you're doing. But if you want to go back, it also pins what you've also done. 
So if you want to sell, you can sell your initials. You can sell a buy amount. So a token amount, you can sell a percentage. I want to sell 10% like so. So it also does our profit and loss card, which, oh, congratulations, you've unlocked. Let's see, level one. What do I get? So we, we've got, because it's such a low amount we put in, but you get the idea. So it's very simple to use. Remember, there's three steps. Save your private key, change your gas settings, change your network, and then you can trade away, make a deposit, and then try it out and see how it is. The link is in the description. I'm sure you've already signed up, but I wanted to do a helpful tutorial for you guys. I wish you all the best and take care.